um, it's so inspiring. This is so precious, this process that you're having as a couple. It's beautiful. She's always going on about pounds. Why would you, why would you not give your wife that? <laughs> oh, so you were actually, she actually, she actually, in, you enjoy when she talks about you like that? <laughs> we share the same idols, <coughs> except for Pound. I don't know what she's talking about. <laughs> Dogs, the poet, sex, John Don. <laughs> oh, when you gave that lecture last oh. week, I was transported. I just felt like I was flying over the hillsides, over the beautiful buttercups. Buttercups? Yeah. Allergy to buttercups. Emily, could you just be a little bit more facilitating of your wife coming out and being nice to you? I love that you loved the way I lectured. Which I, <laughs> I, I thought I was in my element. I really you did. were, you were so. And I saw your face in the <coughs> audience looking up at me with those glistening puppy eyes, and I said, That's my wife. Yeah. That's my girl. Doesn't, doesn't my that, biggest fan. Doesn't that feel better? Isn't this precious, this, this sweetness that you're sharing? Isn't this amazing? <laughs> it, 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 yes. Yes. <laughs> I, I, I'm yeah. getting a tinge of resentment there, Mr. Hanson. Uh, and then when you juxtaposed with the E.E. E. Cummings, the blue-eyed boy, the little Mehitabel approach. <laughs> yeah, T tell me more. <laughs> yeah. I thought I was going to die of sadness. But then I was transported, reincarnated. <laughs> Beyond transportation. This is this is what it was like when reborn. She and I were new, and she was my my grad student. <laughs> <laughs> You're so fresh. You can get that back. No, I can. If you'll be my biggest I fan. I don't care about all those other students. Don't talk about that. <laughs> Okay, sex, sex session is over. <laughs>